What's up, people? It's me, Crimson. And according to Joe Ho, I'm a legend. So, <clears throat> what's up, people? It's me, Crimson. My status has been officially set to legend. And this is a raw red moment. Alright, so, as you can tell, I'm outside. That was the moon. You know, it's not, it's late at night right now. And, uh, probably by the time I upload this video, I have uh, uploaded a video to the Dream Cinema. So, uh, you can go check that out and all that good noise. So, uh, yeah. I wanted to talk to you, man. I, I, had, I had something on my mind. You know, I'm at, I'm at work right now. You know, I'm seeing people walking around and shit outside. Hopefully, they don't notice that I'm talking to myself on a camera. But, uh, I had stuff on my mind, man. There's some people who, uh, it, it's like this, man. Um, I'm hearing a lot of people bench, uh, well, a lot of women bench them on about how, uh, the fathers of their children are not, you know, doing their job as father, knowing good and well that the father that they claim to be the father is not the father. You, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, I kind of hate this bullshit, you know, it's, it's like every time a woman comes up and says like I'm a single mother, the father doesn't take care of the child and stuff like that it, it, It's, it's kind of like this, it's kind of like I feel for you, but what's the real story behind it, you know, it's kind of sad that I have to Have to think that, you know, in this day and age, you know, you, you know, It shouldn't even be like that, you know, it should be man and woman have a child together they raise a the child in a ha nice happy home and you know have more children and you know live successful you know or uh, have happy lives you know but nah it doesn't work like that man it's always a bad story it's always like uh, the woman uh wants to have a baby because her maternal clock is ticking and uh you know so she just has like massive a lot of sets with the guy and the guy you know if he's a um, normal typical heterosexual male it's not going to say no I mean if a woman's putting it out there and the woman's like attractive and shit and you want it you know you know you're going to go after it you know it's it's like that so you have a whole bunch of sets you know she'll probably you know put holes in your condom or like that or you know you might go bareback and uh, fucking go and then you know next thing you know she pops up with a baby and you're wondering like how the hell did I get you know and the guy's wondering like how the hell am I the father when we work condoms all the time so he gets suspicious thinking the woman done cheated on her or the woman did probably cheat and you know it's like that and a whole bunch of stuff and then the guy just leaves her like I'm not taking care of somebody else's kid if it's not mine she's like you know give me a DNA test and all that shit she said no it's yours you know you don't need a DNA test it's yours it looks just like him that's not gonna fly now that's not the case with all um, children you know uh, or all women with pa uh, parents sometimes uh, women with babies sometimes it actually is the uh, guy's child but he's not ready so he just bails you know but I'm just saying you know stop giving I'm just saying you know stop you know giving guys all this shit over you know who's the father of the uh, baby you know it, it, it's a two-way street it takes two to tangle here I'm just saying you know you gotta have some responsibility on the on the mom too you know, you know whatever whatever it is you know you know, you shouldn't be trying to, you know, have a baby with somebody who's not ready to have a, a child. Or, you know, you shouldn't be having s multiple sets with a dude and then when a baby comes up, expect the people that you just, you know, messing around with to step up and be a dad. You know, they didn't ask for that, they just asked for sex. And, and that go and, and, and a special note to all the teenagers, man, what the fuck is wrong with y'all? I mean, really, man, y'all go around and have sex, you know, with any and anybody in high school or junior high yes they have sex in junior high and, uh, and you know next thing you know uh girl pops up with a baby and 
you know, oh, now I can get on MTV and be on um, Teen Moms or 16 and Pregnant. Oh, I'm going to be uh, MTV famous and like all the other bitchy whores. <laughs> And that's basically what it is, and, and, and MTV's glorifying this, but you know, you got to place some blame on the, you know, on, on parents too. I mean, what the hell is wrong with you parents here? I mean, look, when when I hit puberty, right, first you want, when I hit puberty, the first thing my parents did is take me down the street to the UDF. My dad bought me a box, my first box of condoms and told me straight up, wear these bitches out on these bitches all right so that's why i did and that's why i'm this old and i don't have any baby um baby mamas floating around i don't have any kids you know floating around that i'm not claiming or anything i have none and no one can say i have kids because they'd be lying because i know i'm protecting myself and you know you parents out there with daughters man give your kids um birth control uh, pills don't go into shit like oh um I, I raised my um daughter in a wholesome religious family you know insert religious here and we don't believe in condoms and uh other birth control pills because it's against our religion and shit man fuck that shit man you better get your kids some birth control you better get your son some condoms and your daughter some birth control pills all right or else you're gonna end up with a whole bunch of uh unwanted pregnancies and shit and stuff like that man you know you know teach your kids about safe sex you know fuck all this you know uh, abstinent shit man that's that shit ain't fine you know and, and for those of you who think that it is man come down to my hospital see how many teen moms are out uh, uh, down here right now teen moms you know have don't even got their driver's license yet they have to take the bus here all right but that's my little rant. I don't know how long I went, like seven minutes. So I had I had to get that off my chest, man. It was something that uh, you know kind of got on my nerves a little bit. But this is Crimson, uh, legendary status. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know how I can switch to a, like a happy mode after my little rant there. But yeah, um, I think my video should be up on the Dream Cinema right now. I don't know. I'm outside. I don't have internet assets right now but uh yeah if it's up there then check it out um put a link in the description or uh, on the screen when it uh finally is up but uh please rate comment and subscribe it's crimson out